Jimmy Kimmel is back hosting the Oscars this year, and I am so excited to see who wins the awards and who wins the red carpet. What's your pick for Best Picture, John? Oh, yeah, that's right. You could care less about award shows. Well, for the rest of us, and me included, I will be rooting for my favorite stars and films to win when the Oscars air on ABC on March 12th. I love that Avatar Way of Water and Top Gun Maverick were both nominated, as those were fun films that I really enjoyed watching. If you're like Nicole and can't wait to watch the Oscars live, you have lots of options, and none of them require cable. Here are five ways to watch the Oscars without cable. Now, we know that record numbers of Americans are cutting the cord, so it makes sense that viewers have asked us how to watch the Oscars without cable. Let's start with our first and best way, and that's with an antenna. The 95th Oscars air live on Sunday, March 12th on ABC at 8 p.m. Eastern. If you use an antenna to get your locals, you can stream the Oscars and ABC's on the red carpet coverage. Last year, it began at 1 Eastern. If you don't have an over-the-air antenna, watch our Mohu Leaf review video. We have several Mohus on TVs in our home and use them to watch our local networks. After a one-time upfront cost of around $50 or less, you will get all your locals free for life. But you may live in a place where you don't get reliable antenna reception, and if that's the case, you will need a live TV streaming service. So our second way to watch the Academy Awards without cable is through YouTube TV. At $65 a month at time of filming, YouTube TV is a little cheaper than our next two options. It includes all of your local networks, so you won't need an antenna, and a wide range of sports, news, and entertainment networks, including E!, which hosts an awesome red carpet show. Our third option is another live TV streaming service, Hulu Live. At $70 a month at time of filming, Hulu Live is a little more expensive than YouTube TV, but it includes all your locals as well as E! and a host of other popular networks. Plus, it includes a Disney bundle, which comes with Disney+, Plus, ESPN+, Plus, and the entire on-demand Hulu library of content. Now, you may remember that Disney, which owns ABC, aired the 2023 Oscar nominations on Disney Plus this year. It's not streaming the award show on Disney Plus, but you can watch it on ABC with a Hulu Live subscription. Now, on to a fourth way to watch the Oscars in 2023 without cable, and that's Direct TV Stream. We aren't huge fans of Direct TV Stream since it feels a lot like cable and its packages get expensive really quickly. But its lowest tier entertainment includes all your locals and E! Entertainment Network and costs $75 per month at time of filming. We've done a video comparing YouTube TV, Hulu Live, and Direct TV Stream, so watch that for a deeper comparison of all three. Now our next option includes all of your locals and E! and that's Fubo. Plans start at $75 a month at time of filming, but are really closer to $90 when you factor in regional sports network fees. And while it's a solid live streaming service, it does end up being the most expensive option on our list. You can watch our review video to learn more about it. There is one streaming service we didn't mention, and that's Vidgo. Here's why it works, but we don't recommend it. At $65 per month at time of filming, it carries the same price point as YouTube TV. It has ABC, but not CBS or NBC, and it doesn't have E. Honestly, it just doesn't stack up with the other options on our list for watching the Academy Awards without cable or satellite. Now, before we wrap up our take on how to watch the Oscars without cable, we want to answer a question viewers have asked us, and that's, can I watch the Oscars for free? While you can watch the Oscars online at abc.com or through the ABC app, you need to subscribe to a participating cable or satellite provider to access the Oscars live stream. All of the streaming options we mentioned here will work, and Fubo, DirecTV Stream, and YouTube TV offer free trials at time of filming, so you could try those to possibly watch the Oscars for free. Additionally, the only way, though, to really watch the Oscars for free is through an antenna. After that one-time upfront cost, you'll get all your locals free. Well, that does it for this video. How are you planning to watch the Oscars this year, and who are you rooting for? Let us know in the comments below. And if you haven't already, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you can get all our latest news and reviews when they drop. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in our next video.